Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Happy New Year 2024. This is the first video of the new year and I want to start off with iOS 17.3, the next major update coming to the iPhone. Of course, in this video, we'll talk about expect the release dates for the next beta, expect the release date for the official release. We'll do a quick refresh of some of the features. Keep in mind, it's been nearly a month since the previous beta Apple released iOS 17.3 beta one on December 12th last year. So let's Let's get right back on track. Let's go ahead and dive right in. Okay, so I want to start off with a quick recap of some of the latest new features coming to the iPhone with iOS 17.3. In case you forgot, it's been nearly a month since the first beta. The first beta for iOS 17.3 was released on December 12, 2023. So one of the biggest new features coming to the iPhone with this update is stolen device protection. Now this feature will require Face ID authentication to change your Apple ID password it is secured by a security delay as well. So it helps you stay protected if someone ever gets a hold of your passcode. The same passcode you use to unlock your phone, that passcode can also be used to change your Apple ID password. And this aims to protect you from that. So if someone knows your passcode, they can't go into your phone and change your Apple ID password or anything like that. So one of the biggest upgrades in years to security on the iPhone phone with stolen device protection should be hitting our devices with iOS 17.3, which I'm super happy to see. Now with iOS 17.3, Apple has re-enabled collaborative playlists within Apple Music as well. So if you jump into Apple Music and you go into playlist here, let's go into my playlist. I can choose a playlist and right here it is. Collaborative playlist is now re-enabled and hopefully will make its debut with iOS 17.3. Now there's also emoji reactions. Take a look at that. So with collaborative the playlist you also get the new emoji reactions just like so in iOS 17.3 with Apple Music. Now in terms of performance, I know you guys always like to ask in regards to the battery and performance. There is only one bug I've noticed so far with iOS 17.3, and that is that the home screen widgets sometimes disappear from the home screen. Nothing major, but it's something that's currently happening in this beta. In terms of battery, I have to say I'm really happy with the battery so far. I can't complain in iOS 17.3 other than that performance is pretty pretty solid. So with that being said, when can we expect the next beta? Well, if history is any indication, now I want to say that Apple will most likely release the next beta on the week of the 8th of January. Typically the first week of the year, Apple does not release any betas. So the next beta will most likely happen on January 8th or the 9th. So just keep in mind that we're about a week away from beta two for iOS 17.3. Now in terms of official release dates for the software, we'll most likely see the official release of iOS 17.3 towards the end of January. I'm thinking the week of the 29th. So the very last week of January, Monday, the 29th, 29th, we'll most likely see iOS 17.3 officially released to the general public with some of the latest new features as stolen device protection and collaborative playlists. Now, of course, Apple will most likely release another two betas, the RC and then the official release, as I mentioned, towards the end of January. So we're back on track. We're just about a week away from starting the beta release cycle from Apple here. Just a few days now. Thank you for watching, guys. I hope you guys enjoy this quick follow up and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.